what's up guys this is sunny back with another video and today i have another pc right here now as you guys can see this pc is kind of old uh, i have here dell optiplex uh, 3040 and i kind of got this pc for free so basically what happened uh my next door neighbor they bought a brand new pc and they didn't know how to set up so they kind of you know asked me if i can help them and uh so yeah, I did help them set up their new Dell PC. Uh, I don't remember the exact model. So they had this old uh, Optiplex uh, 3040 just laying around and they were like, uh, can you please take this PC? Cause uh, you know, we don't have any use for this one. So I was like, uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this one. So, so basically <laughs> I am sharing with you guys um, and uh, I want to hear you guys thought, like, what do you guys want me to do with this uh, Dell Optiplex, uh, this old uh, PC right here? Um, I kind of like this, uh, you know, Optiplex uh, 3040. It's not all that big. It's like a uh, MATX uh, form factor. And uh, also, you guys can see it does come with uh, the optical drive, okay? Uh, I know no one cares about the optical drive anymore. It does have two USB uh, uh, 2.0 Type A and then uh, two USB 3.0. Uh, you got the headphone jack right here. Uh, seems pretty cool, right? And I also believe this PC comes with uh, Intel Core i5 uh, 6500 CPU. So that's a quad core CPU, uh, no hyper threading. And yeah, that's a Skylake CPU. Now, real quick i'll show you guys uh inside of this pc also uh it doesn't have uh like the hard drive or graphics card or anything uh they were basically using this pc for like you know like uh, a work purpose um i actually took the hard drive and gave them it was like uh 300 uh a gig uh 320 gig uh a mechanical hard drive so let me show you guys uh this thing is kind of dirty I don't know what to do with this. Please let me know what should I do. Should I build a budget gaming PC? Should I build a budget hack and torch? Build? I don't know. Okay. So uh, let me see if I can open this with one hand. Uh, so basically I was trying to plug this uh, uh, PC uh, to my monitor and see at least this thing turns on because they were telling me they didn't uh, like use this pc for a while so i don't even know if this thing working or not so let me open this side panel real quick okay here we go side panel is pretty solid cool i leave the side panel right here now as you guys can see inside uh i believe i have to remove this part first right uh, okay so i have to remove this front panel first so let me remove this front panel yeah guys i did my dd you know all right plastic front panel okay and now Oh, I don't know if I can do this with one hand. Let me see if I can remove this. Oh, yes, I did it. So basically, you just have to pull this, right? All right. Cool, cool. All right. So here you guys can see inside of the PC. Well, this thing is really nice. Like, really, really small. Like, not all that big. Um, wow, the power supply is really, really, really tiny. Um... I want to see the oh that's a 240 watt power supply mm, maybe maybe uh i can use my uh the amd rx 6500 xt graphics card the mini uh graphics card i have okay um yeah cooler seems pretty dirty and also let me see how many gig uh, RAM this thing comes with. I don't know if I can open with one and oh uh, no. Okay, let me remove this. All right, so. Uh, does come with eight gig uh, PC3L. Okay, so hold on. Um, I know Skylake CPU support the DDR4 RAM. 
So, hold on. So this PC basically... Okay, so we can install DDR4 RAM. Hmm. Because here, uh, for DDR3L only. Wow, so it does come with 8 gig. I might have to order like 8 gig more because uh, I highly recommend for gaming PC. Nowadays, you should go with 16 gigs RAM. All right, guys. So this thing is pretty dirty. The doesn't come with a didn't come with a uh, hard drive okay but hard drive cage is here uh 3.5 uh, hard drive cage right here and also a 2.5 hard drive cage right here and so basically let me see one sata two three we can use one of uh this sata plug for like uh, i don't know for graphics card or maybe we can remove this power supply and get a new power supply i don't know i'm not really looking to spend a lot of money in this pc uh, maybe I just um, built a, a budget gaming PC for, I don't know, because I didn't pay nothing for this PC. So what we can do, uh, I'll see like, you know, how much this PC goes on on eBay, right? Um, you know, maybe maybe this PC goes for around 120 or $150. And I'll see after adding a graphics card and uh, RAM and uh, SSD, how much this PC will cost. So I don't know. I don't know if I can, uh, like, I don't know, three hundred dollar gaming PC, something, or hack and torch, three hundred dollars. Now, before anything, let me put this uh, RAM back. <sighs> let me install this RAM real quick. So sorry for breathing so freaking loud. Uh, okay, it's. I don't know how I'm gonna do it oh man okay working on pc with just one hand not so cool all right let me see if i can turn this pc on there is no hard drive there's nothing all right oh i need to i need to plug this uh display cable to the display port right here all right and uh, the power switch is right here okay so there is no graphics card so uh let me let me see if this thing oh it's not turning on hmm oh no it's turning on oh yeah okay the fan is spinning the rear fan is spinning the cpu fan is spinning okay i see keyboard light okay let me see some type of uh text or something i don't know Oh, virus. Okay, okay. Okay, I see so, uh, Dell support assistant. So that's main. This computer is working, guys. Yeah, I'm making that uh, that noise because uh, there's no graphics card, there's nothing. All right, this, you can see Optiplex 3040. Okay, let me turn off before my wife <laughs> watch that man because <laughs> uh like around like 1 a.m right now like it's, it's crazy it's kind of late all right guys so stay tuned uh let me know what type of content you guys want me to make with this uh free uh pc right here um does have intel core i5 6500 uh uh, CPU, that's a uh, four core, four thread CPU. There is no hyper threading, uh, eight gigs of RAM. But uh, these, okay, so this PC support only DDR3 RAMs, not DDR4. And I was kind of surprised. Also, the power supply is only 240 watt. So maybe I can go with like a uh, RX uh, 6500 XT graphics card. And I don't know, I'll pick up a uh, SSD or maybe I have one laying around. All right, guys, let me know what you guys want to see. Uh, that should be it. See you guys next one. Peace.